Okay, uh, this video I want to talk about Pokemon Go and I want to give some good advice for people who live in a rural area when they play Pokemon Go. Uh, if you don't live in a city or you live in a, like this place, live in a village or close to the forest and you like to play Pokemon Go, uh, one thing is very good to do if you want like a very good Pokemon, like a very rare Pokemon, like a, maybe a Gyarados or a, a Venusaur or a, like Shellisar, this kind of Pokemon, or uh, and the, like Aerodactyl and this kind of. The thing you can always do is of course one thing is always uh, if you have if you have non if you live in a place you have no Pokestop. Uh, you cannot get any uh, like Pokemon like ten ten kilometer uh, uh, ten kilometer egg or two kilometer egg. Uh, one thing you can do is like this: if you have uh, uh, lures and you have is no Pokemon on the screen, like it's no Pokemon, no Pokestop. Use the lure for the the lure. The lesser Pokemon they are, the more more you can get more rarer Pokemon you're gonna get from the lure in this, uh, when you use it and the other thing if you have some uh, some Pokestop you can always uh, hatch egg like if the more egg you hatch the more common you get 10 kilometer egg and you get more rare Pokemon in 10 kilometer egg uh, it's like Snorlax and this kind of thing and uh, yeah, so always, like, oh, like always use, uh, like, what am I, yeah, like this, always use a different tactic, like the f first tactic is always to use a lure, it, it always use a lure when there's less Pokemon on the screen, like if you are in, in a, close to the forest, and you play with no Pokestop, n no Pokemon, always use a lure. Lure is very, very good in special time pe times, like uh, in time on the clock. Like if you, I think it's more common to find rare Pokemon in the night uh, when you use a lure. It with, it, it's totally uh, uh, in the forest place area when you play Pokemon Go. And and if you live close to a river or a sea, you can always go there and use like a, a lure or a spawn to get Magikarps or a, a, even if you're lucky you can find a Gyarados. So it's always, the, the best tips is always to give different time period uh, in the place you are and different time period can give you different Pokemon. So like if you like one time you are like so like this so if you are in a place uh, like in the morning close to the water use uh, uh, use lure but be very careful to use the lure in right time don't use lure if you, you see any Pokemon on the screen don't use the lure if you find a place to uh, close to the sea with is no Pokemon at all. You can find nothing, or you can still use. You can still play play Pokemon Go where there's no Pokemon there, and it's no. Uh, you can you can throw the ball. You can do anything like this. So if you it's no Pokemon on the screen, and you are close to the sea, use uh, the lure. For it's very possibility possible that you can find a good Magikarp, or, if, or even if you are lucky, a Gyarados. Uh, so one thing to find Gyarados is always be close to the sea, and always be a, uh, use, always use lure when you are placed when it's not, it's no Pokemon there. For the less Pokemon there are, the better the lure gonna, the better lure will find, and uh, the lure for the final Pokemon. And the, the more Pokemon like this, it's like that. It, it's like almost like a big box, like a lure is almost like a big box. The more thing you have in the box, it's harder to f uh, it's much harder to find the, the good thing in the box. It's like if you have like 
thousands of uh, uh, f apples and in the bottom of the box you have one uh, strawberry that is kind of the lure so the strawberry is the rare thing like example so always try to find a box and it's totally empty when you use play pokemon go and then you use lure and if you are in holidays it's more com it's better to use lure on holidays on uh, uh, places with there's no pokemon very more common to find rare Pokemon in the holidays. And other tips I can give uh, for play people who play in rural area: when a new generation Pokemon come out, new generation generation one, two, three, four, five, uh, always the se the se exact day the gen the they release the new generation, always go out and look for new look for the Pokemon. For you always gonna get. Um, a bigger chance to get good uh, Pokemon in the start of the release, and if you wait, so like if someone if they release now they reach five, uh, generation five, so uh, so if you're uh, be too late, always be first to go out when you know they release generation six, go out the se same day and look go look uh, look around and use the lure and so on. It's always the best thing. You're always gonna find the mo most rare Pokemon in the start of the release of the Pokemon. Uh, when they come out, if you wait too long, the they are the more Pokemon come out, the more rare they they put the, uh, away, uh, put away uh, more harder to get. So always go out in the start when they release a new generation. Uh, the other tips is after that is. Um, is if you have uh, a raid group, very it's very good uh, for find legendary Pokemon. But you don't need a raid group. You can also use uh, the seven day stamp to the breakthrough. You can also get Pokemon from the breakthrough. But to get the best uh, Pokemon is always from egg, like a, a, a ten kilometer, two kilometer, seven kilometer. Uh, and five kilometer eggs, and oh, and always when there is a Pokemon Go advent, like a shiny advent for a new Pokemon, always go out and try to catch it. Even if, if even if you have no Pokemon on your screen, the same day you have a use alert, for you will have. A, a, I promise you, you will get some of them Pokemon. At that day, so it's always, always good to go out, even if you don't see any Pokemon on your screen. Always use a lure at that day, the the Pokemon Go advent, for you will oh, you always gonna get that. Is you will always get some of them, and this you get, and you can even get them shiny if you are lucky. So that is a very good tips for uh, royal players that always use lures if you see no Pokemon on the screen. It's, uh, that I mean, a very, very important thing. This is very important. You, you have to look very carefully when you walk before you use the lure. If you see any Pokemon on the screen, on the catch screen, or on the uh, screen at all, any Pokemon, don't use the lure. But it, you don't, you only you want to get a PG or a Rattata or the new version of them through the lure. So always use lure if you are a total clean screen. There's no Pokemon there, there's no Pokestop. The only thing that the Pokemon Go need to work, you need to, if, uh, the, the, they need to work Pokemon Go. But you, you can, if you use a lure when it's Pokestop, it's not gonna work. Uh, that thing. So always use um, the lure when it's no Pokestop. That is gonna give you the higher chance to get uh, more rarer Pokemon. And especially if you do it in the evening, there's more, uh, any more higher chance you get. Maybe we can find uh, Aerodactyl and uh, Dragonite. Uh, I, I, I live in a rural era, uh, area and I have seen like maybe one time or two times, uh, one time a, uh, a Dragonite, a wild, 
and wild Gyarados. And that is rare. I only said this one. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, two times Dragonite and one time Gyarados uh, uh, f evolved Gyarados. So uh, it's a perfect thing if you are in a place with the Pokemon. Po you can play Pokemon Go, but you find no Pokemon. It's a perfect thing to use a lure. If you wait, like maybe to a Friday or a, um, in the evening, like uh, seven o'clock, and you use a lure, you be biggest chance if you fight, you're gonna find more rare Pokemon that way. So lure is always good for, uh, to use them when there's no Pokemon on the screen. So if you find you have to be like you have you have to really really know if find no Pokemon on the screen, you have to really really be sure, sure uh, certain that is no Pokemon on the screen at all. I, I, and if you like, if you wait, you have to maybe wait uh, twenty five minutes. And if you it's no Pokemon after twenty five minutes, then you can use the lure, and if then it's, you're gonna get gooder Pokemon. And the other thing, if you live in a uh, 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 royal area, but when you when you still have pocket slope, you always use uh, always uh, uh, um, hatch egg. Hatch egg is a, the most uh, re most rewarding thing uh, for uh, royal royal uh, royal players. If you want a good Pokemon and much candy to the, the Pokemon, you hatch. So always hatch. The more uh, egg you hatch. Uh, the more chance, the more ten kilometer egg you will get. The more ten kilometer egg you can get, Lapras, Snorlax, and uh, and so on. So more f more faster you're gonna give good Pokemon, and this kind of thing. And uh, I yeah, so that is my uh, tips for royal uh, ro royal players to find gooder Pokemon more easily, and this kind of thing. So use the uh, element to your benefit like water to find a uh, uh, magic carbon dragon uh, a magic carbon gyarados and blaster is this kind of pokemon and use use always the uh, uh, the, uh, the environment for uh, for different kind of pokemon is very important and different time period will give you different pokemon like different like one o'clock will give you one pokemon two o'clock or uh, six o'clock or eight o'clock Will give you other Pokemon, so always the time is very important too when you will find Pokemon. I think the more common to find rare Pokemon in the evening, and to find rare Pokemon in the day. So use always use the time is very important too. So that was my video for some tips, and yeah.